Hello, you are almost done with this LibreKey course. There's one final project to do. I would like us to just add all of the fun, cool things that we have made into a nice little impress presentation. Really, it's going to be a slideshow of sorts. So let me pull up my example that I have created. And you will recognize this from the LibreKey site that you guys have been using for this course. So there you go. I'm going to open it with Open Office and Press. And remember, we made one of these just a simple little shell earlier, so you should have this saved somewhere. Go ahead back to it. Left click, Open Office and Press. And here you go. So, here are the five slides that you should have. You have LibreKey applications, your name, where you work, the date. Introduction podcast slide. Here's your PDF exchange viewer slide with those two screenshots that I showed you how to make and I'm going to show you how to go ahead and embed them into a presentation like this. Same thing, there's our DIA diagram, the PNG file, and there's two options of your PNG files that were created on Inkscape. So, how did I embed these things? All right, so I'm just going to go ahead and make a new slide to show how to do the adding of these files, documents, cool things that we've made. So I want an introduction podcast. So there you go. If your options ever go away, you can show, slide this out a little bit. These are all your different options. There's your properties, there's your layouts. So we want to do our introduction podcast that we made with Audacity. So you just go ahead and add a title, introduction podcast. There's your title. Okay. So you see this little box here? It gives you four options. Insert table, insert picture, insert movie, insert chart. Well, that Audacity podcast that we created it's an audio file. So we're going to go ahead and use the insert movie and we're just going to left click on it. And you need to find where your podcast is saved. Mine's saved on my desktop in my LibreKey course under models. There you go. Baird intro podcast. So you select it you left click where it says open there you go you don't really need that giant megaphone looking thing to be so large you can just make it nice and nice and small maybe center it so now when you actually play this in a slideshow it will actually talk to you and let me show you what I mean. So let me delete that one. Okay, so I'm going to go into slideshow mode. I'm just going to hit F5, just like you do on Microsoft PowerPoint. There you go. There's my first. And then when I go to the next slide, it's going to play that podcast. Okay, and I just hit escape to get back out of there. So, there you go. That's how you embed that. Next one. Next one. How do I want us to add our PDF Exchange Viewer? Well, let me do the same thing. I'll add a new slide. 
and I'll show you exactly how I wanted you to do that. So we're actually adding two things to this slide. So you're going to want to go ahead and choose the layout that has title and two content right there. Go ahead and put the title, PDF, viewer, there you go. Okay, there are my boxes. We're going to be adding picture files here. We save these screenshots as PNG files. Go ahead and left click where it says insert picture. Well, I want to have a comparison. So here's my blank PDF. Choose that PNG file, open, and there it is. Just to make it a little bit bigger, you can go ahead and stretch it out. There you go. There's my blank PDF. Do the same thing over here. Insert picture, left click, filled out PDF, left click, open, and there it is. Make it the same size as the other one, just for comparison's sake. And if you want to know how that's going to look in slide sharing mode, you hit F5. And there you go. You can see on this side, not filled in. This side, filled in. Wonderful. Hit escape and move back. Okay. Now the DIA diagram. How do you add that? Again, you just have the uh, diagram. Then you just click so that your little box comes up. Again, what did we say this as? A PNG file. So we're going to insert a picture. Left click on where it says insert picture. Here is my created DIA file. Click open. There you go. Wonderful. If you wanted to make it bigger, there you go. You could do that. Hit F5 to check it out. Look at that. Wonderful. And finally, the Inkscape examples. So I created two. You might have only created one. Either way, if you created one, just choose the title and content. If you created two, go ahead and click title and two content. Even if you went crazy and created a bunch, you have options of adding a bunch down here. So adding two, you have ink. Escape examples. Again, just click off of there to make those little boxes come back. Again, what are you inserting? Pictures. So, pictures. There's one banner. There you go. Insert picture. There's my other banner. And there it is. Then you can just go ahead and file save as. You should have this already saved from before. Go ahead and click save. And there you go. You have your final created LibreKey presentation with all your fancy examples. And you even created it using Impress from the LibreKey. Thank you very much for your participation in this LibreKey course. And I hope to see you hear from you again. Thank you very much. Bye-bye.